a group of Irish horticulturists believe that they may have discovered a cure for a destructive disease that's been attacking horse chestnut trees. They're carrying out tests on trees at the Phoenix Park in Dublin. It's part of international drug trials to combat horse chestnut bleeding canker disease. Rotting bark, discoloured leaves, disfigurement and eventual death. The effects of the rare but deadly bleeding canker disease on horse chestnut trees. The horse chestnut trees here were the first in Ireland to be diagnosed with bleeding canker disease. Around 10 of them were felled and buried deep underground to stop the disease spreading. We've over 20,000 trees in the Phoenix Park and on Chesterfield Avenue alone we've over 150 horse chestnut trees. So we in last year actually decided uh, to look at some trials with regard to different chemicals, uh, biodegradable chemicals that we could use to see if we could improve the lot of the horse chestnut trees here. So last autumn, around 10% of the Phoenix Park horse chestnut trees took part in a sort of international drug trial. Some of them had their leaves sprayed with an antibacterial multi-nutrient formula, while others had a garlic extract injected into their trunks. Today these knobbly scars are all that's left behind from those drug trials, and the good news is that the trees seem to have been saved. As of yet, there's, not, there's no real sign of any lesions or anything yet on the bark or the tree yet. So, so far, so good. Everything has come into leaf well. We're very optimistic for the future that a, we will have, hopefully, a, came across of products that will actually help the horse chestnut trees. The full results will be known in late summer, but so far it seems the Phoenix Park trees have helped to discover a cure for bleeding canker. Katrina Perry, RTE News at the Phoenix Park.